Hello guys, Mio, Welcome to Gaming, and what you're looking at is something kind of interesting, I found interesting. I uh, come across this DDR3 uh, adapter type module in a computer that was brought in today for recycle. Um, the person didn't need it. The computer works, but they had gotten a new one and they didn't want it to go to a landfill, so... We recycle them, and when I say recycle, we don't necessarily destroy them. We will use the parts out of them and other repairs or builds or restore that computer to a working order and donate it to a less fortunate family or a nonprofit organization like a fire department or library or something of that nature. But that well, was kind of interesting that this has a, this computer had this in it. It's a uh, DDR3 240-204 adapter. It's uh, currently set to module mode. It's got your four-way dip. It's got a control chip on it there, it looks like. At mill chip, 418. At mill, 418. Uh, second row is 24C02N. And the last row... Boy... Can't see that, can you? The last row is issue 27D. So 8-pin uh, chip. It's probably similar to the uh, the onboard uh, drivers. There's trash all in this thing. Man, that's nasty. Similar to the onboard uh, drivers on the RAM itself to tell the BIOS uh, what it is. And it had laptop RAM and a an Nanya 2 gigabyte PC3 10600S 1333 is the speed here. And yes, this was working. This was what was in it. There were two of these in there to make four gigs. Um, just thought I would. It's made in Taiwan. Now, I've seen these on eBay, but I've never been brave enough to actually buy them and try them. So I might. So now that I've seen them working, uh, I guess if you wanted to repurpose your laptop's RAM in a desktop, and, you know, it's not my personal taste in computer hardware. I like to use what is meant for the machine, not adapting things. Hmm. Two of 2015, it's date code. Yeah, I thought I would uh, show that off. I, I, first time actually having one in my hands.